Moving on now, China's image in India is steeped in stereotypes. It's often dubbed as a fire-breathing dragon ready to attack India. But beyond the geopolitical compulsions that force Beijing to adopt an aggressive stance against New Delhi, there are several unknown aspects about Chinese interests in India, as Nitin Gokhale shows in this report from Beijing. My name is Mani. Hai. My name is Anurag. Hai. These are not characters in a play. These are real students learning Hindi at Peking University. Even their teacher Wang Jing calls herself Chetna. They all feel that it is important to feel like an Indian to learn Hindi. And that's why the Indian names. Meet Dr. Jiang. The man who has revived Chinese interest in Hindi after first learning the language 20 years ago. अभी इनको ये realize हुआ है कि यदि भारत के साथ business करना है और भारत के साथ यदि मैं यदि आ गया है प्रोफेसर चियांग की तो एक तरह से आप माने या नहीं माने तो competition तो जरूर है ये healthy competition है. Then there are others like Isha Elias Jiang who first learned Bharatnatyam and now teaches the dance form to her Chinese students. It's so attractive, uh, like uh, the eyes movement, the emotions and uh, the hands mudras. It's very interesting. China may have left India behind in many spheres like economy and the military might. But here in Beijing, India finds a lot of resonance among more and more Chinese, especially in terms of language and Indian food. In Beijing with camera person Suresh, Nitin Gokhale for NDTV. Chuba.com